What is up, you guys? It's your boy Electroflame JD in the house, back again once again for a beautiful, wonderful self Center revenge. And today, people, today we are here for E1 and M4, the God Tower, on Heretic Shadow of the Serpent Rider. Thou art a Smite Meister difficulty. There we go. I said it right. This will be done by 100% kills, items, and secrets. I hope you guys enjoy, and let's get on with the show. Hi there. How are you all doing today? I'm a sleepy emperor. That's what I am. So, it is Thursday today. And I'm hoping you guys are enjoying your Thursday morning, afternoon, and evening. Because as for me, I have my coffee here, and I'm going to enjoy this one. We're gonna meet a new enemy. We're gonna meet him at the exit. Spoilers. Let's get on with this walkthrough and I'll show you what I mean. First thing I'm gonna do is grab my necromancing glove, open this door, grab the spell book, and we're gonna put the spell book to good use. Really true. Oh, there's my my berserker. But anyways, let's quickly, you know deal with impies over there and uh, quite difficult very challenging very big map is what I got to say but this is what a big map should look like with beauty and everything anyways let's carry on slaughtering these enemies because they are a pain especially these flying little devils so let's quickly kill this guy quickly. And then that one next. So let's quickly open these doors. Don't go further than that because we're going to make a decision. Open up this one. And again, don't go further than that. I hear you. I hear you. There you are. It's better to stay here. And see what they're doing next. Because you're quite safe here. Really true. Now then, turn to where the wall is. The two doors that we opened between left and right, you have a choice to make. Because I'm not going to go left. I'm going to go right for a very good reason. Because close by is a secret. So, if you look with a necromancing gloves, Oh, and quote unquote, we still need to snipe. Where are you? I'm gonna forget about you at some point. There we go. And you too. You're annoying. You're annoying! I don't appreciate it! Okay. You all are annoying. Just leave me alone. Anyways. Where you see the necromancing glove when you pick it up, go back to this falcon wall over here and then lower the wall. You're gonna work for it though. Jump down. There you go. Take the teleporter, but again, you're gonna work for it. Grab immediately everything, but go back to your egg and then clutter them all together and. Boom! I like doing that. I really do like doing that. This is a very, very difficult keys where you put it in. I can make it easier, don't get me wrong. I can make it easier. So, your first and only secret, done so. You don't have to worry about secrets anymore. So, Let's quickly clear some mummies. Uh, over here, you're gonna see these mummies have developed a new spell. Yes, they have developed a new spell. Okay, before we deal with those killer archers over there, the skeletal archers, let's first deal with everybody outside. That includes going around. Did you see that? Show it again. There we go. Now, 
they can summon their own lost souls. The only difference is once they have a lock on you, they follow you immediately. Like a revenant missiles that can follow you like to say 10-20%. This one is automatic like that. They follow. You have no say about it. Let's clear the whole room up and make sure that we have everything gathered. So no matter what, Archer or Crossbow, every last enemy outside before venturing into the inside parts. Especially here. Because as you can hear, I'm being I'm being scratched. There we go. We'll worry about those guys up there later. For right now, let's continue our merry way outside by slaughtering these monsters. Okay, again, we will worry about them just now. We will come back for them. I promise. We will come back for them. Anyways. Oh, you got knocked off, I think. You see. He just saw, shot a lost soul. And me. But I have a better plan for you. I practiced it. I practiced it. And it's gonna work. We go in here. And voila. We are back at the beginning area. So it doesn't matter which area you start from left to right. Why I chose right is because of the sea. And then I can get the jump on the other enemies. That's the reason why I did it. Anyways, we've got a uh, quell arrow here. And from here, we're going to take the advantage on sniping you from down here. There we go. Next one. And I can hear you. I'm gonna so love and get a nice jump scare that one of them is gonna come behind me from the uh, from this entrance side. Okay. But I know where they are. I can hear them from the opposite direction. Grab your elixir. And then straight after that, interact with this wall. We'll grab the shield just now when we finish the map. So, as you go along, just, you know, look in each dark and cramped corner, and we should be done so. So what I'm going to do is flip the switch, but I'm going to make a mad dash from here. And that was the idea. Haha, <laughs> sucker. You followed me all the way here. That's good. I like that. So, very quickly, let us... I know where the other creatures are coming from, so I don't have to worry too much about it. I still got 70 armor, so I'm way okay. Or should I say 70 shields, so I am perfectly okay. So, uh, let me check and see. Oh, excuse me. It is very hot here. It's about, I think, 30 degrees here in South Africa now. Okay, doesn't look like I'm missing any more kills. If I do, I will hunt some. It's not a problem. But I mustn't miss items. So we've got four more items left to go. So, let's have some fun with mummies and some devil eggs. You're boring. Stop in fighting. Anyways, the rest of the screeches that you're hearing is around the, this corner over here. We're going to take this one. We're going to take the stairs first. I don't want to go through the other stairs just yet. The other stairs is got a passageway where I want to kill more of these guys. Yes, there's more of them. Like I said, we're going to put our spell book to good use. Normally, I do not want to do that, but hey, it's worth it. I get to snipe you. Yes, 
my pea shooter over here that is a wonderful sniper. Though. My wizard, my wizard cube wands. There we go. There's another one right over there. Go ahead. And I'm an assassin. There we go. Okay, so later on there will be a third one over there. Let's interact with this door and kill you. And then kill you. And now I feel happy. Down the stairs. Because you tried to kill me. Grab the elixir. And another um, archer just transported himself. Yes, I choose this corner over here. For multiple reasons, like you, a stray, <coughs> and two, the Pinky. Uh, so, even though you cannot strafe left and right properly over here, you're still in a safe advantage of him over there. Because no matter what, he will snipe you from down here. Trust me, he will. Really, truly, he will. And we have the crystal of, of invisibility. The shadow sphere. There we go. That's what it's called. The shadow sphere. Now we take this one. And like I said, we're going to put number four. Uh, number four is the spell book to good use. Okay. <clears throat> From here, we go backwards. And then, this is what the spell book does it powers up your weapons, no matter which weapon it is. And then we should have all items. Let's put the spellbook power to good use by going up here. <coughs> up here. So yeah, these both don't hurt you, so don't worry about that. They just do double the damage. Meet our sorcerers! So we have bad sorcerers over there, and we have a good wizard who's trying to save the world. Should be in here. Yes. So they leave some uh, dungeon claw with us. Ah, and that's it. I don't have to hunt anymore. Again, I will check. That is all kills, all secrets, and all items. The God Tower. That was very fun. This is how a big map should look like in Doom and in Heretic. This was fun. Really, truly, this was very, very fun. The aesthetics of the map, amazing. Beautifully done. This is the type of map I would like to see. If you're doing a big map like this, do it pretty. Do it nice. Make it shine. Make it challenging. Because that is what I want, and that is what I call a challenge. We got the new enemy, the sorceress, and spoilers, I think it's about episode 5, I believe, we are going to meet up with his daddy. With they daddy, sorry. With they daddy. Not my daddy, they daddy. But yeah, amazing map. I like what John Romero did. I love what um, it software did and the Raven crew also did to um, make this map amazing but I think I've spoken too much guys and girls I hope you enjoyed this part of the video if you did hit that thumbs up, thumbs up for me over there show YouTube you loved it if you didn't enjoy it eh, you know exactly what to do subscribe to the channel for more support and hit that notification bell for more of these walkthroughs by Let's Plays other game channel against whatever comes in the way guys and girls Thank you once again for watching. Stay frosty, stay safe, stay strong, stay healthy, and remember one thing. There is a flame that burns inside of you, so ignite it and flame it. Cheers, guys. Adios, cheers.